Okay, we already had it, uh, what, Thursday morning a moment ago. So That's right. We're, we're all right. And you know what we're <laughs> going to do right now? We're going to look at the snow report. I'll uh, head up to the top of the mountains. This snow report brought to you by Worcester Black Home. It's kind of a good news, good news picture. Even though it didn't snow, it was too warm to snow for it last night. But it stayed dry under the cloudy skies. Conditions now have cooled down. Your alpine elevation temperature on the slopes of Worcester is a minus three. Uh, there's no new snow, 137 centimeters, your total snowpack. Talked to my buddy Warren yesterday, who said the slopes are in great shape in the alpine over the top half of the mountain. Beautiful on Worcester and Black Home these days in spite of the lack of snowfall. Here's your reports over the local hills. Mount Seymour, 138 centimeters, your total snowpack at the peak elevation. Uh, yesterday it was plus seven at this hour. Goodbye to the temperature inversion, courtesy of the clouds moving in overnight. Now it's zero, so it's cooled down quite effectively. On uh, Cypress, I believe they have 100 centimeters, their total snow base, plus three right now. And again, it was a half a dozen degrees above zero at this time yesterday. Uh, Grouse Mountain was plus eight at sunrise yesterday, and now it's plus one. It has cooled off. It's going to remain dry over the slopes of the north mountains for the next several days and the earliest uh, possibility of snowfall looks like it's going to happen sometime uh, around uh, Monday night and Tuesday of next week. Zero right now on Mount Washington. 80 centimeters your total snowpack with no new snow to report and of course there's no precipitation in the lower mainland forecast either. We have cloudy skies kind of lasting for a good chunk of the day today. It may clear a little bit but not that much. It's more so tomorrow Friday and Saturday when the mornings are colder and foggier but the afternoons brighter and sunnier likely warming up. We'll flirt with that 10 degree mark heading into the the start of the weekend. Sunday's fairly foggy and fairly cloudy, about seven degrees. And there we go next week with a distinct cooling trend and also uh, looks like some wetter weather showing up. Riaz, finally, some rain for the south coast.